Oh my god, Sparky. I am beginning to think that the Baltimore Ravens might go to the Super Bowl this year. The only way the Dallas Cowboys are ever gonna make it there is if they have a ticket. Ha 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 ha. Good night. <laughs> Good grief, Deke. What happened to you? It looks just like someone glued a long piece of toilet paper onto you. Oh, wouldn't you like to know? Those damn idiots, at CVS Pharmacy, just gave me, a receipt long enough, to almost measure the entire length, of a NASCAR stock car. And I only purchased one item. One, item. Great Scott. My mom, was in CVS Pharmacy the other day. She ended up buying a bunch, of beauty and hygiene products as well as some cases of Mountain Dew, and a new deck of playing cards, for her Tuesday Bridge Club. You should have seen her receipt. It was almost long enough, to cover the entire length, of two CSX diesel locomotives. Holy Screen Gems. Does CVS Pharmacy, really have to waste, all that paper? I guess their cashiers get paid, to hand you, the longest receipts in the world. I swear. Their receipts are so long, I could wipe my ass with them. <laughs> it's a wonder, that they don't have, a Guinness World Record, for the world's longest receipt. Seriously. If you only purchased one item, then, why is your receipt so long? Well, if you must know, I'll tell you the whole story. I was over in Longshanks this afternoon. I was on my way home, after a wrestling match, with the Viacom V of Doom. Then my stomach started rumbling, and I decided, I needed a Snickers bar. Now, you know me. Normally, I buy a Snickers bar, from one of the Valero stations, here in my anus. But since CVS was close by where I was, that was the only logical choice. Well, anyway. I decided to fly in there, and purchase a Snickers bar. And things went all normal you know. I was gonna grab my candy bar, and get out of the store as quickly as possible. So I decided to pick up my Snickers bar, and this is what happened, as I was handing it to the cashier. Welcome to CVS Pharmacy. My name is Diane. How may I help you today? Hello, Diane. I would like to purchase a king-sized Snickers bar, for $1.49. Yes sir. Please hand me your candy bar, and I will ring it up. And so, she rang up my king-sized Snickers, like a normal cashier would. Then, this happened. Okay sir, with taxes, your total is gonna come to, $1.57. And so I hand Diane, two gold socket Jawea dollars, to pay for my Snickers bar, and told her to keep the change. Then, this happens. Thank you sir. Please, take this receipt with you, as a record of you, purchasing this candy bar today. Lady. Are you kidding me? That receipt is way too long. I only purchased one item. That receipt has nothing, but a bunch of stupid coupons on it. I'm sorry sir. I know we have some long receipts here, but, it is a requirement, by this store, 
that you take this receipt, so that our shoplifter detection system, does not go off, and the cops, don't get called on us for it. All right. Fine. I'll take the damn thing. I have a million things I can do, with this Googleplex-sized piece of paper anyway. Okay. Whatever. Thank you for shopping at CVS Pharmacy. We sincerely hope that you will return again soon. And we hope that you will sign up for our Extra Care Loyalty Program. And so, there I was, leaving the store, and eating, my king-sized Snickers bar, that I rightfully purchased in my left hand, and my super long CVS receipt, blowing in the wind, in my right hand. I did kind of regret it though. Maybe I should have gone somewhere else, to purchase a candy bar. And so, that is how I ended up, with this long CVS receipt. So, in short, why are CVS's receipts, so long again? The reason why they are so long, is because, they try to target their customers, with long messages, and an outrageous number of coupons, from their so-called, extra loyalty program. Remind me, never to buy Doritos, from CVS. I will just go to Food City, and purchase them. <laughs> Thank you.